expect you to be here. Well, well, that makes us even now, doesn't it? How is your sister? Yeah, better than ever. You know what, Marty, um, I think I changed my mind. I think I'll stay. Um, no, it's all right, Dylan. I think I know why Blair or she has talked to me. All right. But you, uh, you think about what I said, all right? All right. Take care. makes a nice watchdog. Well, I think I can save you a lot of trouble. If you're here to make more threats about Andrew and me. No, 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 I'm here not to talk about Andrew, but to talk about you and someone else. Todd Manning. No, so if you don't mind, I was just at the station where they questioned me about Todd Manning's whereabouts last night. So? So? I told them that I saw him in the park that his hand was bloody and bandaged. He was upset, but he wasn't violent. We talked. We went our separate ways, and that was about midnight last night. I can see how the police might find the staff's name, but I really don't see what... I saw Todd at the station, Marty. Really? You two are becoming great chums, aren't you? We understand each other. Oh, that doesn't surprise me. Marty? Todd told me that he was with you at the hospital at 11 p.m., the same exact time Rebecca Lewis was attacked. Oh, Todd says a lot of things. Oh, even Todd can't be two places at once, Marty. That's assuming you believe it. I do. Well, that's your problem. Good night, Claire. No, no. That's your problem, Marty. Now, according to Todd's attorney, you refuse to even back up his alibi. Because it's not true. Well, I think it is. Well, I think it is. 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 So either you go to the police right now and tell them the truth, or... Well, don't stop now. Or what? Hospital 11 p.m. last night, the same exact time Rebecca was attacked. Yeah, well, Todd says a lot of things. Even Todd can't do two pages at one time, Mom. Oh, but that's assuming you believe it. Well, I do. Well, that's your problem. Good night, Blair. No, 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 no. That is your problem, Marty. According to Todd's attorney, you won't even back up his alibi. Because it's not true. You see, I think it is. And I think you are lying. Now, either you go to the police and tell the truth right now. Or... Well, don't stop there, or what? No, let me guess. You'll start spreading lies about Andrew and me all over town. That does sound like you. <laughs> you see, unlike you, I don't have to live for revenge. I learned the hard way what bitterness and hate can do. Come on, Marty. Don't make my mistakes. You know that Todd is innocent, and you know what you have to do. Yeah, I'm gonna get a lesson from you of all people. Blair Day was gonna tell me how to live my life. You're right. I know, I know what I have to do. It was done a long time ago. I'm not back where you belong.